Hey guys, it's Annie. It's that time of the month again where I get to share and unbox what the November Simply Earth sub oils and recipes are. Um, I've done several of these videos as I have gotten these boxes. I just love to share um, the things inside because I get them maybe a little bit sooner than you do and you know what's coming up or whether it might be worth it to start your subscription at this time. So let me just go through the oils and the different things that they have in here super quick. Um, I am super excited about this box because they have candles. I have been wanting to make my own candles um, with essential oils, you know, just these healthier candles for the home and things like that for a while. Um, and it's just one of those things I never had time for. But the ingredients, um, some of the items, basically everything except the jar are here in this box and that makes me super excited and already just like give this box a thumbs up. So the oils for this month are a blend called Love. So this one has a blend of amorous, bergamot, sweet orange, and ylang lang or however you say that. I always know I'm like, I'm sure I'm saying it wrong. So this one is a lovely scent. This one is lime. Everyone pretty much knows how lime smells. So it's a great one. I love the citrus ones. Pine. Now, this one I was like, mm, do I really want my house to smell like a pine tree? But I have already uh, tried a couple of these blends. And when you blend a little bit of pine and like these girls know what they're talking about. They, you know, they're certified aromatherapists, I think is what you call their you know, their degree and their certification and things like that. Um, and they put together these, uh, these scents for the different recipes. They know what they're talking about. And if you use them in the right amounts, this just adds some notes to the other scents and it smells really good. And then you don't smell like a pine tree. And then the last one is so seasonal. I love it. It is nutmeg. So that is a fun one to have this time of year. Uh, it's really nice to smell like I've been baking without actually having to put in the dishes and the work of baking. Okay, so not only do you get oils in a subscription box every single month at a, at a great price, but I love the recipes. So the Love and Spice Diffuser Blend, I have already tried and it smells lovely. Uh, so that's one of them. And then I already talked about the candles. So there's a love candle, which this is really fun. It's winter. The days are darker. There's so many more inside activities. This would be a lovely one to just burn in the bedroom and um, snuggle up with your spouse. Wax potpourri discs. This is a fun one. I love anything that's going to make my house smell lovely. And I really love it when you can maybe put something in the bathroom or something in your car or something in a closet as well because my diffusers don't always get into those kinds of spaces. So this is really cool. And this is where, oops, where the beautiful dried flowers are for. So you kind of make these discs with your the soy wax and the beeswax and obviously the scent. So I'm excited to make that one. Um, anything that is a, a, a healthy energy boost, like an energy blend, I really like those. It's a great thing instead of having another cup of coffee in the afternoon or drinking the, the disgusting energy drinks. I always like to be able to put on some oils, either um, through a roll on and put them on my person or to even put the the oils in my diffuser so the room can be scented. I really like that. It can be really helpful. And sometimes I'll use something like this um, if if I know that the blends are fine and the oils are fine for kids. I'll do it like during school. And I really feel like it helps us with focus and motivation sometimes. There are bath melts you can make with the love scent. That would be a really fun one. And the second candle is the Winter Woods candle. And this is the other scent that I put together because I was like, lime? Lime in a, in a kind of winter themed box? Like I don't think lime when I think fall candles, but when you do it with the right amount with the lime, pine, and nutmeg, it was actually a really delightful scent. And I never would have guessed that there was lime in it, um, probably just smelling it. And it just, it, they work together. They're a team. So it was, it's, it's beautiful and it smells really good. 
So I am excited about those. Um, I want to show you something I think I failed to talk about um, every single time I've unboxed these, but it actually took me personally a long time to realize that on the back of one of the recipe cards are the four oils and will tell you some of their uses. So like the pine, it's warming, it calms, and it supports circulation. Uh, dilute it before using it on skin. So they give you some general safety information. And these are my favorite because I feel like these are going to apply to a lot of people. Um, a lot of us maybe have kids and a lot of us maybe have pets. So we personally don't have any pets in our home, but I still love that they put this on here because cats and dogs, there's a lot of oils that are not safe for them. So you don't ever want to use them on your pets or maybe on your hands if you're going to be touching your pets and also they talk a lot about this in their videos so they have these like five minute videos where they'll talk about the oil this is on their youtube channel i will do my best to remember to link it down below they'll talk about each oil individually they'll have a five minute video on each oil and they'll talk about the actual science behind the chemistry of that oil where what part of maybe like the plant that it comes from so where it comes from how it's um processed sometimes, how it's used, how to use it safely, how to use it safely with kids, and how to use it safely with pets or not to use it. So I really love that they just aren't, they're not just trying to sell you oils, they're really trying to help you use them in your home and in your life to be energized and healthy and to have these beautiful aromas. So I really appreciate their extra effort and they just make it available for you you know, on their YouTube channel. So this card, I like to tuck away in the same place that I keep my oils. So that way, if I am in the middle of the afternoon and I'm dragging a little bit and I'm like, what are those oils again that I can use that were uplifting and energizing? And then I just kind of go through my cards real quick and I find, oh, lime is one. Maybe I'll put some of that in the diffuser uh, with maybe one or two others, or maybe I want to energize and uplift so I could, you know, blend these together. So this has been really helpful. I can't believe it took me so long to realize they're right here on the back of the recipe cards, but there they are. So I highly recommend trying this out. If you're not sure that if you're ready to, to go for like a whole subscription um, and you'd rather try out just a couple of oils uh, on your own or something like that, um, you can just use my link down below to get to the website and you can see all of their oils and you can get them all individually. Uh, you can definitely find a bunch more information on their website and their blog as they have presented how to use the different different oils and different ways you can use it in cleaning or use it in your home and, and things like that. So um, do not hesitate to check them out and find out more information. But I was excited to unbox November's kit for you or November's sub box and share with you what you can expect if you're waiting for that shipping notice to come. So thank you guys for joining me. I hope you love your box. Let me know um, if you've tried the box before, which which month was your favorite so far that you've tried? Or what oil is maybe your favorite? I would love to know uh, what you love the best. All right, guys. See you next time. Bye.